morning, dear souls. There's a certain silence in the air today, which is Uh, it's hard to describe, but it's it's as if something has shifted, and there's a, a stronger element of peacefulness. And my feeling is that over the last few days, there have been a lot of people out there meditating for peace, for love, for joy, for happiness, for kindness, for harmlessness, and creating um, a world that honours all life forms. And my feeling is that a shift has taken place because of that. It's you know, when enough of us get together to co-create what we wish with open loving hearts, miracles happen. When we can do this for our own selves, we can do this for a plant, a tree. Um, power of our intention is so important to use whilst we're here in these beautiful physical bodies on the earth plane. Um, so many people get caught up in the the treadmill of life, getting up, going to work, taking it all very seriously. If they don't answer so-and-so's email, my God. And it's all just part of, part of a very old structure which is crumbling. And the sooner uh, people realize this and can see it for what it is and start using their energy in loving ways, uh, the quicker this change will really, really come into fruition. I mean, we're, we're already, you know, in a very different passage of time and New Earth is certainly here. Gaia's frequency is much higher than it ever was, 5D. And uh, many of the human beings on this planet are already walking in high frequency, embodied in that love with open hearts, living life um, with an ele well, not an element, but uh, with full, full uh, dedication to service, to the collective, in love and through love. And, um, and I can really feel a difference today. <sighs> something in the, something in the air, something in the change. When you get um, practiced in feeling your body, feeling frequencies, feeling the energy that surrounds you and feeling the inner energy within you, then you get really sensitive to any changes. You get sensitive, very sensitive. A lot of people are sensitive, they just don't realize it, they override it. Um, because of their own traumas, they might be people pleasers, they might be, I don't know, any, any number of, of traumatic responses to life, but so many people just override how they're feeling um, to fit in. And that's, that's not what any of us should be doing. We should be living in truth um, with healthy responses, being aware of what fits with us and what doesn't resonate with us so that we can create highest outcomes for all beings with respect and with love to all beings so um yes i wonder if anybody else is feeling this change in frequency today or whether it's just me in uh, my universe <laughs> uh, 
enjoying the fields, not wearing a coat, walking with Lanto. So anyway, I wish you all a beautiful day and know that you're loved, you are love. And if you're going through any challenges right now, remember change is always happening and we can co-create and you can create much better. You've just got to focus your intention in the area of your bliss and stop thinking about all of the things that are displeasing to you. It takes some practice, but it can be done. It definitely can be done. And uh, I send you all love. Have a beautiful, blessed, joyful, peaceful, and loving, nurturing day.